Photography, it's such a wide genre. I would say photography to me means the art of communicating visually. My name is Brooke DiDonato and I'm a freelance photographer based in New York. I discovered my passion for artistic photography. I was in high school and I started mixing like painting and drawing with photo and then when I came to Kent I found out that there was a program for photo and didn't really know what I was getting into. Then when I was doing an internship I kind of had this like rebirth I guess of creativity where I started doing like self-portraits and uh, photographing my friends and using them as like models for my ideas and I would say that there were sort of two turning points. One was like in high school and then the second one was at Kent in like 2012. One of the things that I learned at Kent that I feel like has transitioned into almost every job or freelance gig that I've done has just been communicating with people and making them feel comfortable. There's something that can be really uh, invasive about like putting a camera in front of someone's face and a lot of like the journalism classes that I took were sort of about like opening up to people so that they can open up to you and I think that I still use that even though not in a journalistic way I still use that in my practice today. The relationships I had with my professors here were really supportive and nurturing. I would say like Gary Harwood, who I worked with very closely throughout my time here and I think there were times where I felt like giving up and he would always encourage me to see the things I'm doing right and so I worked with him very closely. I would say advice that I have for photo students would be to practice all the time and never stop shooting and refining what it is that interests you. I think don't be afraid to repeat yourself. I think a lot of times people think, uh, oh, I've already made this photo or, you know, someone else has done this already, but I think that, you know, a lot of my work is not, I'm not reinventing the wheel. It's not like I, I do a lot of photos with flowers. I'm not the first person to use flowers in photos. So I don't think that people should be afraid about, you know, being the first to do something. They should just think more about doing it to the best that they can.